finally, they're rolling again. The horsepower rockets of the DTM. And here in Marshall Slaven, round one gets underway as the lights go out and they thunder towards the first corner. It's pretty special to see the continued support from the fans and uh, also all the teams and the drivers. You know, the quality is such a high level. The wild chase for the championship trophy starts in Oschersleben. The first race weekend of the season serves up a complete package for the fans. Excitement, drama and a bit of glamour. It's my big pleasure to be here. This jumpsuit, I wanted to, to make concurrence to the driver. You know, they're all having their driving suits. I wanted to make a jumpsuit. So I made it like very glamorous to be here. Schubert Motorsport in particular wanted to deliver at their home race in the Magdeburger region. For the BMW team, however, they needed Alka-Seltzer more than champagne in race one. Problem for Marco Wittmann. The BMW drops back. Poor old Marco Wittmann. Ferrari driver Jack Aitken celebrates his very first victory of the new season. First on his car, then in the fan zone. Autographs from the GT3 Aces are very popular at the season opener, especially from champion Thomas Priney. We're queuing here because the DTM drivers are sitting back there and we all want an autograph. I think Thomas Priney is cool, that's why I'm here. DJ Tomek provides the appropriate soundtrack next to the circuit legendary hip-hop classics. The race on Sunday is also spectacular and heated. In the end, Luca Engstler wins in his Lamborghini for the very first time in his DTM career. The season opener in Oschersleben, one that whets the appetite for more.